All right, buds, uh, here's my third video. Just want to kind of show you guys what I've been doing. I know I haven't made a video here for a few days. Sorry about that. I've been really busy. But uh, I got the uh, second tables built in the uh, back room here. And uh, just kind of want to show you guys how I did that. And I right here I cut this out. Uh, I'm not sure if you guys have seen PGH train fanatics uh, layout if you haven't you should he kinda gave me this idea actually a lot of ideas I've gotten on here from him and uh, Bravo 6 kinda cut this out this is gonna be a river scene I built that bridge there so it's gonna be a little valley into a river or creek or something and then uh, coming over here to the other side of the room we've uh, got the yard set up and I uh, got a couple of my bumpers there lit up and uh, that's where you come through there coming this way and uh, here I've actually started some scenery and uh, it's looking pretty sweet I'd say right here with the ceiling tiles I also got this from PGH Train Fanatics layout it was so awesome I just had to recreate something like that and uh, thought it looked really cool not sure if you guys can really see the detail there what I did no, my camera's not the best, but just kind of show you there. Bought some of these little trees, started making them. Actually, my girlfriend's been helping me and my mom. Today, I've actually had my mom, my grandpa, my girlfriend, my dad. Everyone's been working on the layout today. It was a pretty fun day, so got a lot accomplished. This, I still need to put some ground cover on this hill and uh, start the mountains here and uh, put some more of that. Uh, ceiling tile there to make that rock face kind of made try to make it look like we were going through here and we had to cut through the mountain and uh, there's another tree kind of in the way there and uh, started doing a little bit of ballast a little bit of ground turf there but I'm sure if you guys can really see the detail in real life it looks tons better it looks awesome but yeah I just kind of want to show you guys that and uh, now I'm going to do a couple run-in shots of the train. Maybe do a little ride around the layout or something like that. But uh, thanks for watching, guys. Really appreciate it.
Sorry guys, I forgot one thing I want to show you all. Uh, I actually weathered all my uh, cars here. Hopefully you can see the uh, detail I put on them. I mean, it was my first try. thought I'd go ahead and give it a go. I mean, I think it turned out pretty nice. I like how it turned out, so I uh, just kind of brushed some brown acrylic paint on there. Real watered down. I'm not sure if you guys can really tell the detail or not. I mean, like I said, my camera's not really the best, and it's kind of dark down in my basement. I really need to get some of those rail lights or something put up there, but I don't know. They look a little bit dirty, and uh, I think they really turned out nice. See on the top there, and uh, but yeah, and I just uh, want to say thanks to all my buds that have been helping me out. PGH Train Fanatic, Bravo Six, Betrain Guy, all you guys you really inspired me, and I uh, really do appreciate all your help a lot. And uh, if any of you guys haven't checked out their layouts, go there. They're the most knowledgeable guys on here. And uh, they really will help anyone out that has any questions. I know they help me. So I really appreciate it, guys. And uh, I hope you enjoyed my videos. Hoping to make here a couple more here before I have to go back to school over spring break. But, uh, yeah, guys, thanks for watching. I appreciate it.